Oh no! Hey! Well, some things can never go well with either or just like this. Not just multitasking like this made me draw this conclusion, but the quantum mechanics has also proved this right. Are you wondering how? Well, let us understand it through. Heisenberg Uncertainty Principle In 1927, Vernon Heisenberg postulated that the more precisely we measure the position of a quantum particle, the less precisely we can measure its momentum. As stated by the equation, delta x multiplied by delta p is greater than or equal to h upon 4 pi. While it doesn't hold much good in the macroscopic world, due to extremely small value of h, but it rules in the microscopic world. A macroscopic object can easily be observed and located as the light incident on the object gets reflected to our eyes. But as soon as we try to do this, to observe a microscopic object, a problem arises as when we attempt to measure the position of micro particle, we tend to use a light wave with shorter wavelength due to extremely small size of a particle since a longer one will create a blurred image. But to measure the momentum of the object at that very instant, we need a light wave with minimum energy and hence longer wavelength to not alter the motion of the particle. Hence, we can either choose to measure the position or the momentum of the particle accurately. Let us understand it through an example. Now here, we have a laser light beam and when we pass it through a narrow slit, we get the light beam as a spot out there shining on the screen. But as we begin to reduce the gap between the slit, then as we expect, the spot shining on the screen gets smaller and smaller. But there comes a point when something strange happens. As we keep narrowing the distance, unexpectedly the spot gets wider. But how? Isn't it weird? Actually, here uncertainty principle is at work. When we narrowed the slit, the uncertainty of the path of those photons decreased and in accordance with the uncertainty principle, the range of variation in the momentum is now increased. As a result, now the light beam gets diffracted in the x-direction. Remember, the direction in which momentum varies is the same in which position varies. Hence, the direction of the momentum varies over a certain range in the x-axis, keeping in mind that we had made the path of those photons precise in the x-direction. Hence, the pattern of the screen is obtained. As they say, quantum mechanics is probabilistic and hence uncertainties are very natural to come across. Hence, this limitation is not some measurement error but the ultimate result of very nature of quantum mechanics and it can't be overcome by building a better device or instrument.